it's Susan here for Komori no Hime Cosplay, and today we're going to be over just a quick trick to turn a tube right side out. So we're going to start with some heavy duty thread and a darning needle, and we're going to thread it through and tie both ends of the thread together. Next we're going to sew through the seam allowance and not the thread. The reason we're sewing through the seam allowance is because we're using such a heavy duty thread it can tear through the fabric and if it's going to tear through the fabric we'd rather have it be on the seam allowance rather than the actual top portion of the fabric. Now we're going to take the needle and kind of fluff up the tube a little bit and we're just going to drop the needle through the tube. The reason we're using the darning needle is because it's heavy. And I have to fluff it a little bit so that the needle goes along so it doesn't get caught on the sides. This tube is also interfaced so that's making it a little bit trickier. Okay, so now the needle has dropped its way through the tube, and we're going to pull on the thread, and you may need to help it along a little bit in the back end there with your fingers, so we want it to pull the tube right side out. Probably also easier to do this when I'm not trying to film it. Okay, now it's going. So you're going to keep your fingers on it and pull the material through your fingers. Just keep gently holding on to it while you pull with the other hand. And as you can see, it's already starting to pull the other end through, so we're almost there. And now we're just going to snip that little bit of thread, and the tube has been turned right side out. I hope you found this tutorial helpful for more cosplay sewing tutorial videos and costume tutorials. Please subscribe, and thank you very much for watching!